Um, let me again uh, cite uh, Bernard Shaw, who's reputed to have said that when he was given the Nobel Prize that he could forgive the man who invented dynamite, but I, that it took the most diabolical mind in the world to invent the Nobel Prize for literature. <laughs> and I, I, agree with, <laughs> I agree with him to a certain extent. Because it has it swelled my constituency. It was already sufficiently, you know, swollen. Uh, because I was, uh, you know, agitated on world stage one way or the other. But it really made life imposs virtually impossible. It's with astonishment that I discovered that I've actually completed a new work, you know, ever since the Nobel. It's, I was sit down and look at it like some strange object. Oh, did I really manage to finish this, you know? So uh, it, it's, it's a mixed, it's a mixed place. I mean, of course, I enjoyed uh, having the Nobel uh, Prize, uh, the prestige that goes along with it, the money that came with it in particular. I was the typical, uh, still am to some extent, impecunious writer, you know, just struggling to make ends meet. So that's, you know, nobody's going to deny that at all. In fact, if they want to give it to me a second time, I'm standing by ready to receive it. <laughs>